How are you doing guys? Another video for you. This is about your range bag setup and some ideas for yours coming up soon. So getting your ammo to the range. Uh, for me, I use this. This is an MTM product. It is the three can ammo crate. Um, each one of these I have filled with a different caliber. Um, generally when I'm going to the range, I have mags loaded in there. They're already preloaded. Um, these actually have to be refilled. Always keep your mags loaded. Um, so this is basically what I go to the range with. It fits really well in the back of my car. Uh, it's very heavy to move around, but you can take each one out individually. Uh, it's just a great storage, in my opinion. Um, this is actually how I store it as well. Um, so this is what I go to the range with. Uh, works very well, has worked very well for me. It was relatively inexpensive. I think it was $30 on Amazon, something like that. Um, but it's just a great way to keep things organized uh, because it can get kind of chaotic at the range. Um, especially where I go in the woods. I don't need to be dropping stuff. So that is what I bring to the range with me. Next would be the range bag. This is my range bag. Um, it is made by Great Ghost Gear. Um, it's a pretty straightforward bag. Um, well made and at the time was on sale and really cheap. Uh, it's got a really nice shoulder strap, also handle straps as well. Um, you have two smaller side zippered pouches, one large on that side and then one here that kind of doubles for just targets is what I usually use it for. Uh, but starting here, you have two zippered compartments here, for smaller items. I believe in this one I've got a Sharpie. Um, this one is empty. Um, but you can use it for smaller parts, things like that. You could probably also get a small roll of tape in there. Um, cleaning kit, that kind of thing would work well for that. And then this on clips and then you have like flat storage here on this side over here I keep a blue gun a spare holster and my eye pro um, would work also for ear pro as well I've used it for that on this side over here I have a full blowout kit um, this is in, in an SOE end fact it, it's a great way to organize your first aid gear and pull it all out without it falling all over the place um, I think it's really important you should be, if you're going to be using firearms at the range, you should have some kind of medical with you. Um, even if you have no idea how to use this, if you have people there at the range with you, uh, hopefully someone else there does. Um, but get medical training for yourself. But anyway, that's what in, lives in this pocket. The only change I want to make is I want to get a big red cross drawn here on the side. That way it's easily identifiable as this is first aid because there's no Velcro spot here to throw a patch on it. So that's the side pocket. Um, in this far pocket here, this actually is kind of cool because this doubles as a workspace. So in this space here, this whole thing folds out like this, and it's meant for your pistol mags. Um, this is all stuff that just came back from the range with me, and like I said before, I gotta reload it. Hey, Brandon. There's some of your mags there. Still haven't gotten rid of your name yet. Um, stapler is good uh, for putting up targets. I think that's kind of a requirement if you're going to go to the range, no matter where you're going. Um, but this is like a rubberized surface. So if you get oil, things like that on it, it's easily wiped off. And there's also two small zipper compartments here. Um, might be good for spare AR parts that are small and can easily lost. Um, I, my place where I shoot's in the woods, so it's kind of important for that. And then now we'll look at the inside. So the inside of the bag. Um, in the lid, there's a zippered area. I use this for my AR tools. Um, I've got an uh, armor's wrench. I've got a uh, rod system that I can push out a piece of brass if it's stuck. Um, I also have a reaction wrench. Not that I think I'll ever need this. It's from Geisley, but it's there if I need it. Uh, and I have a laser bore sighter too that sits in there. And here, you, it comes with this divider that's right here, um, so you can divide the sections up. I have a toiletry bag with about 10 loaded mags. 
Um, I've got just a rag for wiping crap up. Um, I've got my cleaning kit. These flat packs from SOE are the shit. Especially for this kind of stuff. This has all my cleaning stuff in it that I would need, plus some other stuff like Loctite. So that rides in this. Um, here I've got a breakthrough set. I also have some Sharpies too. Because you can never have enough of those. This is meant, I think, for spent brass. Um, the idea of this, if you collect your brass, it's a good idea. Um, here I've got zip, zip ties and some other things to and ranger bands to get stuff mounted back on. And then here I have a tool kit in another one of these flat pouches. And it says every tool I could think of that I might need to get my guns up and running. That way I'm not wasting time because I don't I'm not able to get there as much as I'd like to. So that's pretty much it. Uh, also some rubber gloves and directions to the range for attack response. So that's it guys, that's the bag. It's not too big, not too small, carries a bunch of stuff, um, brings everything that I need. Uh, any questions or comments, put them below and have a good day.